How you doing out there, folks? Yes, it's me, Frankie, the Unknown Songwriter. I'd like to thank everybody that subscribed to my channel and who's following me on Twitter. I appreciate it. Now the comments, I'm not getting many comments. I guess because the songs I've been doing, maybe they're just, I get views. I did Toby Keith, he's a country singer. And I did Trace Atkins, he's also, and they're all still singing now. Now I'm doing uh, some older songs right now. Um, let's see, what was the comment that somebody... Oh, somebody asked me, how, how are you doing all those songs? They, you know, somebody said, subscribe, noticing every day there's 10 songs. There's some days I don't feel like doing the songs. It depends. I have other things to do, too. If I do it like now, early in the morning, it's really early. It's like 5 o'clock in the morning. And I just got done doing them, so I, I made this video. But the way I usually do it is I re might, re I might do 20 songs, or 30. And then the next day or so, I upload 10 at a time. But now, I don't do... This guy thought that I record a song like now, like I'm recording. And then I stop everything, and, and I upload it. And then I record another song and I upload it. That that's going to take an awful lot of time. So I don't, I'd rather have the songs already done, and then I'll just you know the next day I'll do ten. I might do less. It depends. I don't know if it's too many or not. If anybody thinks I'm doing too many songs, let me know. I'll do less. I'll do five a day. I mean, it, I may stop completely. It, it all depends how I feel and all. So that that was one of the comments, you know. I know people wonder sometimes about this, you know, but the fact I'm doing all these songs like that. If anybody wants any songs done, you just want want me to look them up, and you don't have to do that. Fine, I'll do it. Just let me know, and I'll do the song. Somebody asked me to do a, a singer, and I did it. And then I ended up doing a whole bunch of that singer. So, you know, that's, that's all you have to do. If you have any questions about anything, you want to discuss anything with me, or you want me to discuss it here on the video, just let me know. If you want to ask me questions, then I'll answer, and that's all. That's all you have to do. So I appreciate that if you make comments. Don't worry, I'll answer unless something happens to me. Now I have a sort of a little story here. It's not... That's so great. I don't know if I should mention it, but I, I will. Uh, I, mean, I go to my doctors every month. And usually I go, you know, the same thing, the blood pressure, the weight. And I always tell them anything that's happened, you know, anything different. That's what you should do when you go to your doctor. Make sure you know what, before you go what you want to discuss. Don't wait till you go home and say, oh, why didn't I ask him about this? Ask him about that. You should be prepared. So that's why I'm mentioning this now. Okay, so I've been going for over three years to this doctor. And I go every month. And it's been, my, my health hasn't changed too much. My blood pressure has been a little bit higher now. And I take it at home, it's not though. So, you know, as calm as I am in here right now, you really think my blood pressure is going to be high? Not, usually it is, especially if I do these songs. I try to do a whole bunch of songs and I check it because I guess I'm by myself in here, nice and cozy and all. And, and it's it's not. So I went to the doctor and they asked me how I'm doing. I said it's about the same. And, and then it was the lady doctor. I have both. And she said, Frank, you sure there's something you, you want to tell me? I said, not really. If it, all I've been noticing it is some something different. And I've been waking up in the morning with a morning erection. She said, did that just start now? I said, yeah, it started now. It's been every day now for the last, since I've been here. Last time I was here. And, you know, I haven't, that hasn't happened for over eight years since I had the, an operation that I had. I'm taking all this medication. And she doesn't, you know, wasn't, she didn't kind of believe me, you know. But I said, look, I wouldn't, it's not something I wanted to discuss, but I tell you everything. I said, do you think it's the medication? That maybe that I've been taking the same medication so long, you really think maybe, maybe my body's kind of like doesn't react to it so much. 
getting that erection, you think it could be because my blood pressure is higher? He said, I'm not too much about that. Do you want me to examine you and see? There's nothing to look at, I told her, because it's not, it's not erect now. And, and it doesn't in the morning. Now, I know what that is, so I don't pee the bed. Before, I wasn't getting that, and I didn't pee the bed. So she said, well, keep a track of it when you come the next time. We'll discuss it. So I came the next time. But this time, I said, you know, not like she didn't want to believe me. So I took a selfie. So, well, let me take a selfie. You know, I'm taking all these videos anyway. So I took the same camera that I'm using now on the tablet. And I set it up in the bathroom. And I, you know, I had a stool there that I could get up to the right height of the camera and get right in front of it, you know, the a close up. So I checked it before, you know, it wasn't a wreck. So the night before I was going to make the selfie, I drank a lot of water. And I said, I know I'm going to have to go in the morning early. So I got up and it was a, had the erection and I went right away in the bathroom and I took the selfie of it. And it came out all right. I just stood in front of it right away, and I set the, the camera roll, and that was it. I hit stop, and I went to the bathroom. So when I went to the doctor, I took it with me on the smartphone. And I also took it on this tablet that I'm using, this 10-inch tablet, the close-up. I made it on the tablet. And I said, wait a minute, it's not go it didn't go on the smartphone because I didn't, I didn't make it on the smartphone. So I emailed it to myself. You know the picture of the of the erection, and I took it from the smartphone and I put it on the display, and then I showed it to the showed it to her, but she didn't want to look too much. She said, "I want to have the other doctor come in and talk to you. He knows more about it." So he came in and he looked at. It. He said, "Frank, it looks all right. I mean, that means you're healthy. You know, you 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 got good circulation there." He said, even though, I think, Frank, you better get a girlfriend. I know he was only kidding me, but, you know, I, I, because they sell Viagra there and Cialis and all that. He said, you know, I know if I ever got it, he, he, he said it would work on me for sh pretty sure. Because the fact that I can get an erection, you know, when I have to pee in the morning. So I said, I'm not interested in that right now. Yeah, they're always trying to sell pills and all. So now I showed them both pictures and he, he, I said, now, there's a 10-inch tablet. It's filling the screen. Then I have it on the smartphone. It's not the size, the actual size. He said, no, I know. It's not. You did a close-up. So he said, let me know of anything, but you got to be careful with that. Because if you know to call 911 in case that that stays like that and it won't go down or something, you have to call. Because they have to maybe do something there, take out blood or whatever they have to do to make that go down. In case it happened, but I don't think it will. That's caused because you have to go to the bathroom in the morning. You're taking all those pills. So, everything seems to be all right now. Now, I'm going to show the picture that I, you know, I gave to them. Let's see if I have it here now. I'm going to show it on the smartphone. Now, when I show this, the selfie of uh, Mr. Dick, okay, we'll call him that. Now, the camera's going to go red. So, I'm just letting you know, but you're going to be able to see it. I'm going to show you now, so just in case you doubted it, see, see it, there it is, see that's the selfie that I showed the doctor, let's see here, that's it, see it, yeah, it's in the, see on the smartphone, that's the size, but it's not that size, not that small, but it's also not, not big, I, I couldn't put a tape measure, but you know, I was lucky to get that recorded before I, I had to go to the bathroom. So now I'm showing that this is the, the picture I showed the doctor. See it? And that's it. I I, I don't want to do this now. See it? There it is. Okay, I'm going to... That's enough of that, don't you think? It's only an organ. It's a, it's a body part. Nothing really wrong with it. Okay, now I have to... What I have to do now, see the camera? I have to... That caused the camera to... There we go. Back to normal. So now, you saw that. that I mean, I, when I say something, I really do it. Yeah, I'm making videos anyway. I mean, the doctor, he didn't think nothing of it. He said, that's good, Frank. I'm glad that they showed me that because you really can't 
go over here and show me because it's not it's only when you wake up in the morning so yeah so that's all resolved it's it, it, I'm not worried about it I feel all right so okay now back to this I'm doing songs by this Gene Austin back in the 1920s so there's some really old songs and I know some of them I'm gonna do one now after that I don't know which one let's see which one should I do it's not this one I got so many things here oh there it is okay I'm gonna do love letters in the sand 1931 by Gene Austin he was a popular singer then a crooner as you might call it okay I'm gonna start it now